Hello and welcome to the Gaming Chronicles. Today we will continue Fantasy Star 3, Generations of Doom. Alrighty, in our previous episode we finished off uh, Chris's generation, uh, defeating Dark Force for the third time. Uh, it's kind of starting to feel like uh, MMORPG instance, uh, repeating this so often. But now, we are going to... Um, let's see, let's load, right? Yeah, let's load, because uh, slot three, right? Or two? Three. Yeah, because it's uh, the decision whether or not we will marry Thea or Sarai. We chose Sarai last time, and now we are going to choose Thea, who uh, I think it's kind of implied that Thea was our childhood sweetheart or something. I don't know. I don't know if it's the same degree of relationship that... Uh, Reese had with Lena, but Ain and Thea, they knew each other, um, which is interesting because uh, only the, the only couple that, besides Reese and Lena, that knew each other before marrying each other, is Ain and Thea. They're you know they're they're the only ones. Ain didn't know Sarai, uh, Niall wouldn't have known Alaire, uh, and and not Leia certainly you know either of them. So anyway, that's just a little interesting tidbit. Um, Ain asked Thea to be his wife, and she accepted. Lyle and Reese gave their blessings as well. All right, that's fantastic. Uh, they both look like they're. I mean, Thea. I wonder if she's like the same age as Ain. That would be a terrible idea. Why would they give their blessings? They're like, they're, they're kids. They're fifteen-year-old kids. Uh, like, yeah, go ahead and get married. But you know, different cultures, different times. Ain and Thea begin their new life on Far Azura. And that was interesting. The, this is the only generation where when you marry somebody they actually uh, take over the moon. Uh, so that was interesting. Their rule brought peace and prosperity to all. I wonder how that worked out. In time, Queen Thea gave birth to a son, Sean. When he reached manhood, evil rose once more and Sean was called upon to fight for his people. Alrighty. King Ain, something's happening on Eliza 3. And we got Sean and Thea and Ren and Mew in the background. I thought Ren was supposed to be uh, quite a bit taller than Mew. At least a head taller. A flash of light go past us. Uh oh. We're getting blowed up! Oh no! So the Elisa 3 is uh, firing on its satellite, Azura. I wonder if it's... Be well, it's gotta be. It, it, um, I'm certain that it's because Dark Force knows this is where Ain is, and Thea, and his son Sean, and so uh, Dark Force is trying to eliminate the, uh, you know, the... the few people who pose a threat uh, to it. Our beautiful moon is being destroyed! Why? That doesn't make any sense. You should have just come with us in the shuttle. Uh, there's there's room! We know there's room for five people. <laughs> so, um, anyway. <clears throat> and who all and who all moved up here? It would have been right, the... Uh, would have been Ain, Thea, and yeah, all the people of Sil and Shasorin, uh, because we were looking for a peaceful haven. So it's not just us two that would have died. Like the people of Sil and Shasorin would have been then there too. Anyway, journey to your grandfather's homeland. So that's our that's our job. You go to Landon. I'm staying with Ain, but you must go. Very well, they're gonna die. This is this is awful. It starts with a tragedy. Sean, hurry! We must escape. Look how big that shuttle is. That could fit a lot of people in there. And then, uh, unfortunately and sadly, Azura is destroyed by the Elisa Three. And so now we know, uh, as uh, we're lucky to be alive with the crash, we must try to make it to land in Sean. So it's still playing the. Uh, 
the music <laughs> from, um, uh, let's see, where are we? We're like in the middle of the northern part, right? Yeah. So now we've got to go to Landon. Um, let's go into Haz Attack first. So Sean, um, he has three different types of techniques. And so, all right, let's go to Haz Attack first. Oh, we got an encounter. Really? Rude. I don't care to fight these guys. Okay. Uh, hello, has attack. I think that uh, these cyborgs will say the same things as all generations. Well, you know... It might be foolish fighting. However, Dark Force seeks to destroy the entire uh, planet. Oh, or the entire spaceship. Okay, so here we learn immediately, like, uh, since, you know, we haven't been to that pool before, right? Um, find the subparts. So we know we have to find the subparts as well. Uh, let's go ahead and... Actually... There we go. Let's go ahead and redistribute techniques. Sean, heal technique. We want you to be powerful in... Let's give you both Resin Gerez for now. Um, do we want to have you have powerful Zan or Gra or Arzu, I think? Um, hmm... We won't use it very often, but... I want to say let's power out or max out his uh, Tsu. And then... Ren... will actually redistribute yours to Zan. And then Mew. We'll give you Anti and River. Okay, so that should do. Um, I think I just go straight to uh, Landon, right? Because I can go... I can I can take the uh, passageway right to Landon. I don't have to go through Aquatica. Hello, Mune. How are ya? Oh, hello. Ah, uh, so we have a. Interesting, uh, does it? Huh, okay, never mind. Uh, so our parents are dead, and so I think is probably everybody else who would have been a survivor from uh, Sil and Shoshorn who was still alive. It's like, what a, and what a lonely existence anyway, right? I mean, we were living on the moon of Azura, uh, this whole time, and, uh, just hanging out, and... That would have kind of been awful, uh, living like that, living, living in isolation like that. Uh, let's see. 
Who has any healing items? Yeah. Alright, well, we're way up here. We're way up here. I just don't want to encounter any Nashers. Get him. Alright, fantastic. <clears throat> Where is that cave? Uh, now. Nah. What? Seriously? These are all second or first generation mobs. There's no reason at all why. <clears throat> wow. This, that was a ridiculous battle. Ridiculous. Um... Oh, let's use up all this monomate. Oops. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that was dumb. Seriously? Okay, this is becoming a little bit ridiculous. Come on now. Getting ambushed by first generation mobs. There it is. <clears throat> All right. Twins Ruby glows. That's right. It's the twin ruby. Twins Ruby that lets us uh, go. Okay, so we go. I think just straight. No, we don't go straight to the left. We go up. Up one, and then straight to the left. Yeah. There we go. Now in, uh, let's see. I just lost my thought. Never mind. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, hello. These guys are kind of dangerous. And the music agrees. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, try mate. Let's get rid of that monomate, or use the monomate, I should say. There we go. All right, let's get him. Oh, nice. And of course, uh, Sean's uh, overworld sprite is the uh, like the Layan uh, model because he is three fourths Layan. <coughs> See any other? Let's see some die made up. Oh, let's uh, switch out Ren and Mew. My bad. All right, we made it to Landon. Ambushed by a chirper. That's fantastic. Uh, that's, uh, accurately illustrates how well this, uh, our combat RNG has been going.
Alright, so we have arrived in... We surprised the monsters. Alright, way to go, Ren. Alright, let's talk to people also in Ilan and Yata. Let's just hear what everybody has to say. This is our last generation, so why not? See where everybody is, what everybody's doing. Yeah, and I don't think that there's anybody on any of the the shop tops. I think I might do this in the third generation just to illustrate this. Maybe. <clears throat> yeah, I don't... Yeah, there's no one up here. Yeah, I... Eh. I don't think we'll do that. We'll, we'll, I don't think we'll do that. <laughs> uh, it just would have been nice, you know, if uh, they would have included more NPCs. Maybe not to, you know, give you the clues that you need to know where to go to the next area and everything. But maybe just to provide more depth and richness to the game's background and lore and stuff like that. I think I mentioned that in the previous episode, but it still stands. What is Sean wearing, by the way? He's wearing a purple... He looks like he's uh, getting ready to make a 1980s exercise video. Like, he's got a leg warmer on, a purple outfit, white cape. Uh, nothing makes sense. The world's gone crazy. Cyborgs battle the Orykians. Monsters fighting Leyans. Yep, you said it. It's true. <clears throat> anyway, uh, nothing new here. I think we... They say the same thing no matter what generation you're playing. All right, moving on. Ambush, of course. Get him. <clears throat> and let's go ahead and just visit Yata, just quickly. Bustling port city of Yata. Someone's directing the monsters and cyborgs. No Orekian or Leyan can do that. Cyborgs are attacking Orekians. What gives? And I, th I think one thing about Sean's generation, uh, may maybe Chris's too, but more, more so Sean's, because of the fact that you... Um, no, no, Chris is as well, because Chris, you start at Landon, and it's a quick jot to Yata and Elan. But with both of these generations of Ains children, you talk to these NPCs that quickly reveal that in the third generation, you know, things are really going screwy. Um, not only do we not understand why... Uh, well, it's Dark Forest, but we'll, we'll, not only do we not... Do we not understand why Azura got blowed up? Uh, but also that we have this mystery as to why the land monsters are going crazy. You know, why why land monsters are attacking lands? Why cyborgs are attacking Arakians? And so, <clears throat> excuse me. And so the whole uh, spaceship of Eliza Three is. Uh, kind of uh <laughs> trying to trying to survive this impending doom of uh all of these cyborgs and monsters that are um you know fighting fighting them all right let's come up and talk to landon people landon people wow would they be landonites the people welcome you sean how do you know my name Alright, we will 
Let's go up and talk to Queen Sarai. I hear that some cyborgs have turned against us. Uh, well, all cyborgs have turned against you, except the ones that are in my party. Sarai protected us from Loon's monstrous army. Loon was once Leia's most trusted general, <clears throat> but Arachio banished Loon to the far moon Dahlia. No one knows how long, how Loon survived for so long. Well, I do. So, Sarai being the OP knife wielder that she is, she... Oh. This little boy is... Okay. So this little boy is still here. What does he have to say? Same thing he said to Chris. Luna's coming. Run for their lives. Aye! <laughs> I guess it's not. Uh, it's a little different then. Then, uh, if it's Chris. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. And is this, uh, it was a, yeah, there was a person up here. If Ain had married Sarai, we might have won. Won what? If Ain had married Sarai, we might have won. I remember that quote, but I, but we might have won what? The, the the war against the lands and I don't understand what she's referring to why would who would want to destroy Azura yeah no kidding all right let's come up here and talk to Queen Sarai Loon's army has built a bridge over the river he is looking for Leia's treasure in Iridia. Interesting. Uh, so, the same thing that happens in Niall's generation happens in Lu in uh, Chris's or Sean's generation. So, Loon still destroys the Terra no matter what. The western part of this world belongs to Loon. If you had that head that way, be very careful. You're the only of descendant of Arachio left. Huh. It's different. We must end this war before more die. With Leia's treasure, we can stop the fighting. To find Leia's treasure, use an ancient machine that can be found in a world to the southwest. <clears throat> so that's interesting, right? The with Sean, it's uh it's different, you know, the 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 war is still ongoing with Loon, uh, even though Siren has been defeated. Um, Loon is still going strong. Even though at the beginning, when we chose to marry Thea, it said peace and prosperity to all. Obviously, that Sarai has countered every one of Loon's attacks. Thank Orekio for Sarai. Loon can't beat her. It's because Sarai's amazing. All right, so let's go ahead and now uh, everybody thinks that it, this is it's Loon's army. No one has actually seen Loon, but everybody believes it's Loon. Of course, we know better. We know that uh, Dark Force slash the city of Lachute is behind everything. Uh, that Loon is actually not behind this. Save it, yes. Uh, we'll overwrite Chris. Yes. <clears throat> Alrighty, shall we go ahead and... Let's go to Elysium. Um... Let me think here. Yeah, let's go ahead and go to Elysium. We'll, we'll save. We'll save once we get to um, Divisia. Yeah. Okay, so let's head to Elysium.
Oops, we are going the wrong way. But who has the item? We have the sapphire, the dragon's gear. Must be the power topaz. I don't remember. Because we don't go to Elysium as, uh, as Ain, uh, ever. Okay, so let's, uh, oh. Mmm, yeah, we're fine. I was gonna say, let's buy some medicine, but nah, we're fine. The, the overworld monsters aren't really, really that scary enough yet that we... And we're not going to be fighting any scary dungeons, so... We'll be fine. I wonder if we go to Satera if we get attacked. Ugh, ambushed again. Alright. <clears throat> Uh, let's check out Sotera. Yep, it's still in ruins. I don't think there's going to be anybody here, but I'm just wondering if uh, we'll be attacked. Well, oh, uh, doesn't appear so. Yep, no one's here, but it has been destroyed, just as it is in every generation. Or every... Every series of generation. All right. Let's go, Sean. All right. Uh, hello. We'll just go ahead and focus on the Tertius. Ah, but it didn't matter because he got an attack off before anybody else. Dang you, you won, a, you won the initiative. Lame. <clears throat> Alright, here we go again. Oh, ambush, of course, and then we're gonna spam Zam at Zan at me. Blech. the cavern entrance wait um A 75 that's pretty good <clears throat> Come on, just get him. <sighs> Come on. Getting there eventually. Man, every, literally every three steps, it seems like. Come on, get him. <laughs> Dang it. We're doing a bang up job for getting initiative, ain't we? Man. 
and it's really prolonging these battles because uh, we're getting hit by Zan so much. And then, let's see, we have to go down this way, right? Oh, come on! Okay, so, yeah, we need to come down this way. And then we have to go around the mountains this way. Uh, let's go ahead and cast Zan. There we go. Zan should take out the blizzards, right? No? Okay. Thought it would. Just kidding. Hmm. Okay. Uh, we have antidotes, right? Yeah, we have a, we have a few. <clears throat> Lots of fights. Come on. Dang it! <laughs> We have never gotten initiative on these tertius mobs. Whatever. Let's see, what uh, level is it? 38, 38, and 2. Okay. Yeah, our speed leaves a lot to be desired. So, whatever. Man, these frequent random encounters, they really make a long walk that much longer. It's like, really? And we're not even getting good Meseda. I don't care about experience, but it's like, we're, not, we're getting awful Meseda drops from these, uh, these encounters. <laughs> uh, and I don't trust uh, that running away will be very uh, effective, because uh, for, you know, our generation, we're pretty low, pretty low level. Oh, there's no... Oh, that's right. This passage doesn't require any um, any gems to get us in there. Um, let's go... Let's see. I want to get the items to sell them. So let's go up and get the ceramic... Sh oh, wait. Oh, that's right. We're on the top right, not the bottom left. Okay, so let's go... Okay, down all the way to the bottom, right? Yeah. Uh, hello. <clears throat> oh, Sean's a little low. Let's get him up a little bit. All right, fantastic. Uh. Do we have any monomate left? No, some dimates. Alright, we're fine. Alright. Okay, so let's go... Let's see, how do I want to do this routing? Um... Oh, ambushed again? Come on. Uh. I think um, in just about every battle we've taken, 
every one of the mobs that have uh, popped up have um, have attack have like gotten gotten an attack on us, <clears throat> which not only is wasting time but it's uh, causing a lot of health attrition. Okay, so shall we go up and then yeah, we'll just go up. Oh, hello. Man, those are some quick kicks. Good experience. Good experience. Uh... Okay. Oh, we surprised the monsters. Good. Some uh, decent or some good RNG for for a change. We got a break. <laughs> <coughs> Ceramic ribbon. Hello. There we go. Then two over and then down. Man, this is going to be a really long episode just uh, for the fact that we have taken so many fights and and uh, because we're getting ambushed so much, and the just just the fact that the opponents are they're really getting a lot of um, let's see over this one, yeah. Uh, they're getting the initiative on us as well. On top of that, so we'll definitely be saving and calling the episode when we get to. Uh, Divisia. Yeah, get that lash goal. All right. And we'll just head up here to uh, get the ceramic shield so we can sell it. Not necessary at all, but just uh, in the spirit of completionism. And another encounter! <sighs> well, at least we got the front row down. Ouch. <clears throat> nice. Maybe it's two thirds of our technique points, dang. And we're out. Nice. <sighs> okay. All right. Uh, on to Divisia. Oh, crap. Okay, so they're not too deadly. I just... I guess that the green, the green ones, uh, the uh, not the violas, the whatever they are. I thought that they were more deadly as far as damage dealing. Hello, thank you for the welcome to Northern Divisia. It has been a long walk. Okay, um, so anybody to talk to? Just wondering. 
Let's go in this empty house. Why can't we just rest in empty houses? Just pick a bed. Then we could stay for free. Pilot lives beyond. Okay. Yep. Same things. Same things. Alright. Okay, so in our next episode, we will go through uh, Divizia Castle and we will. Um, uh. Oh, yeah, and then we have to go to Iridia. Derp. I couldn't think of what it was. I was like, wait, we're going where next? <laughs> we're going to Iridia next. Um, so, <clears throat> that's our next destination. Uh, now that we have... Oh, wait, no. We're going to go to... Uh, excuse me. We're going to go um, through the castle. We have to go get the subparts for Ren. That's right. We have to go to that western cave. Wow, that would have been dumb. Going back to Iridia and then have to need to come all the way back here so um, that is where we are going the western cave and then we will go to Rydia and pick up Leia's treasure who we know also to be Leia the younger sister so until our next episode so long for now